Oh shit. Oh what? Ah, go John, go John. Ah, my bro, my bro. Crazy, crazy, crazy. These guys are filming commercials out here today. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys my evening routine for muscle recovery. I'm gonna be showing you guys something you can do every single night to make sure that you're performing better in your workouts the very next day. These guys are killing it out here. All right, I'm getting to the office now. Today I'm gonna be working on abs, and fat burning, high intensity interval training. Specifically, I'm trying to burn the lower belly fat area. So I'll be incorporating exercises that emphasize fat burning in that area throughout today's high intensity interval training. All right guys, so we're gonna get right into this. All right, so we're gonna be using the Heria weight vest for today's workout routine. Remember guys, the official drop date to be able to purchase the Heria weight vest is gonna be September 14th on chrisheria.com. All right, let's get into this routine. Here's a good opportunity to show you guys another sneak peek into the brand new Harry Pro update that's gonna be released at the end of this month, late August. So here's the routine, as you can see, it's advanced. It should take you about 60 minutes to complete and it's a fat burning ab routine. And to show you guys an awesome feature, if I press this right here, I can publish this workout. I can determine whether this is gonna be for pro access or whether everyone can be able to see and access this workout routine. And then lastly, add a cover photo. Boom. Choose it, successfully publish the workout. So now when you guys go back to your home screen, you should be able to see it under Chris Harrier workouts, lower belly fat burner, right there. So I'm gonna be consistently posting workouts and workout programs within the Harrier Pro app, and I'll also be posting all the workouts that you see on all the vlogs. But remember, this update is not officially out yet. This update is gonna be coming at the end of this month, at the end of August. So you guys might have downloaded the Harrier Pro app already and seen that it doesn't look like this. Remember, at the end of August, you're gonna be able to update your app and it's gonna look exactly like this. It's gonna work exactly like this and you're gonna be able to get access to all the workouts and workout programs that I make as soon as I publish them in real time. So we're gonna start off with some hanging exercises and then we're gonna bring it to the floor. But the first exercise we have is toes to bar with a weighted vest. And as you can see, it's right here. We got 10 reps to go. So you guys should know by now, squeeze that bar tight. Don't swing, feet straight. Bring it up, bring it down. Next move, we have hanging leg raises. Weight vest element in here. Guys, it's adding more resistance, of course, onto your body. The extra weight is gonna help you to stop swinging, but it's also gonna force you to engage more on your grip, and as well as engage more tighter because of the extra weight that you're putting on. All right, guys, so let's go into these leg raises. Next one we're gonna move into, hanging L-sits with a weighted vest. So this one, guys, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze that core. As soon as you get into position, squeeze your grip super tight. Don't bend your arms, keep your arms straight. Keep your legs as locked and as straight as you can. So the routine in the app says to do these toe touches 20 reps, but you're gonna be allowed to input as many reps as you actually did because every single round, sometimes maybe you're doing this workout and you don't do 20 reps every single time. So it's gonna be able to calculate all those analytics, be able to give you feedback along the way and show you your progress and so forth. But the goal is for 20 reps. All right guys, here we go. Next one we have crucifix. All right, so we're gonna go out, cross. We're gonna come in, touch our heels, and then come back up all the way, complete range of motion. All right, guys, let's go. Ooh, we have Russian twists next. And this one, to me, is probably one of my top three when it comes to burning that belly fat. All right, so we're putting the weight vest back on for this one. Grab some extra weight, some extra credit. 
Honestly, I use an extra weight because when I'm holding it, I can feel the engagement even deeper into my core. So we're gonna go for 50 reps. That's what it says here, guys. If you don't know how it looks, look the exercise. Let's just show you. All right, let's get right into it. 50 reps. Leg straight, one side, other side. Really twist, guys. Three, four, five. So as you guys can see, this weight vest, it feels like it's ripping my body back down to the ground. So this is another great way to apply the weight vest. Honestly, you can apply the weight vest to every single exercise you do. Because at the end of the day, doing anything with extra body weight on is gonna make you hold a lot stronger. Oh man. Yeah, I'm starting to feel that now. All right, moving on. Get seated in and out. And we keep the weight vest on. It's not about how fast you guys do it. In fact, the longer it takes you to do it, the more time under tension you're using. So that's actually gonna be more beneficial for you. So the best thing is to try to do it with full range of motion and as perfect as you can and really feel your way through every single motion. Hold that last one. All right, so the next one is L-sit. All right, it's a 20 second L-sit hold. Let's go for it. Keep those legs straight, keep those hands tight. We have two exercises left. We have plank, and then we have plank side to side. So now we're engaging another dimension, which is engaging our core with our core facing down. All right, let's go for it, guys. Squeeze that core, squeeze your glutes, squeeze your quads, squeeze your shoulders, everything completely engaged. All right, guys, we're gonna move into plank side to side. Let's go for 30. Here we go, one side, other side. Keep that core tight. Round one. All right, so you want to do this whole routine three times to complete the workout. So I got two more rounds to go, and then I'm done for today's routine. Don't forget, you're gonna be able to get this workout routine right here by going onto the App Store or Google Play Store right now and downloading the Harry Pro app. And in just a couple of days, you're gonna be able to update your app. It's gonna look exactly like this. You have this workout routine and a whole lot more workouts and workout programs already available as soon as the new update rolls out for the app in late August, just a couple more days. So if you download the app right now, you're gonna get it before everyone else does. So I'm gonna finish this routine here, guys, and then I'm gonna show you guys my evening routine for muscle recovery. I'm gonna show you guys something you can do every single night that's gonna have you performing your best the very next day, every single time. See you guys then. All right, so we're back at my house, and tonight I'm gonna to show you guys my evening routine for muscle recovery. Now there are a handful of things that you can do every day to ensure better performance and muscle recovery. Of course, when it comes to nutrition, BCAA, branch chain amino acids, it's a great supplement when it comes to recovering your muscles. Now you can get amino acids in powder form, liquid form, and of course in other different types of food, so that's why you wanna make sure your nutrition is definitely on point. When you're working out, you're actually breaking down those muscle fibers and muscle tissues, and when you go to sleep is when you actually repair those muscle fibers and muscle tissues, and that's when you actually build muscle. So the longer that you're sleeping for, the more time you have to repair your muscles and build those muscles which of course is going to lead you to more muscle growth and more muscle development so you want to make sure that you have proper sleeping habits and the third thing that you can do every single day that's going to lead to better performance and muscle recovery is stretching when you stretch your muscles you're releasing all that lactic acid and all those toxins that are held within your body lactic acid is what causes muscle fatigue and muscle soreness so the more you stretch and you release that lactic acid the better you're going to perform the next day because you're not going to feel as sore as you normally would without stretching and another big factor is flexibility. Improving your range of motion is not only going to lead to heavier lifts and more control of your body, but it's also going to reduce the risk of injury. So tonight I'll be showing you some stretches that you can do every single night to release some lactic acid, get that blood flow circulation through your muscles, and preparing your body for a better performance for tomorrow's workout. So we're going to start off with our hands. Now our hands 
carry the most tension because most of the exercises that we're doing is with our hands. So we're gonna start by having our arms straight and pulling back our fingers. And as you can feel it, you can feel the tension releasing from your forearms, your joints, your grips, even your shoulder, bicep if you're keeping your arms straight. All right, so we're gonna flip it down now and do the same. Now we're gonna bring our hand into our side and we're gonna bring our wrist down. Then we're gonna bring our hand towards us like this, grab from the thumb, twist gently into our chest. And each one of these holds should be about for 20 to 30 seconds. All right, shake it off, we're gonna go for the other hand. All right, so now we're gonna go for the neck. So we're gonna start by looking up, chin straight up, and then chin straight down. So we're gonna go gently, we're gonna go about 20 times, up and down. All right, let's go side, hold it, and the other side. Now most of our tension is really held in our neck. So the most you can stretch out that neck, you'll feel it in the rest of your body, honestly. Now another area of your body that holds in a lot of tension is your hips. So let's focus on the hips as well. So we're gonna put our feet planted down on the ground. And from one side, we're gonna keep our legs straight. We're gonna push it straight to the side, just like that while keeping our legs straight. All right, so we're gonna open up a little bit wider now. We're gonna keep our hips straight. And we're gonna look forward, keeping our back straight. All right, now we're gonna go to one side. The more pressure you put down on that knee, the more you're gonna feel it all the way from the back of the hamstrings, down to your calves, and so forth. Switch sides. Right, gently down to the center. Bring it down, put your hands down on the ground. Breathe, relax. Bend, bend, start to go on the heel of that foot, and make sure this foot is flat on the ground. All right, we're gonna come back up, keep this leg straight, start pushing with this one. Now bend this one. Keep this one straight. Here we go. All right, we're gonna bring it back to the center. Legs straight. And try to hold as far as you can up on your legs. All right, let's bring one leg in. And let's go back down. So as we're doing these different movements, I can really feel all the tension releasing from my muscles. And I know that tomorrow, my body's gonna feel great. And I'm gonna be ready to go hard some butterflies. All right, we're gonna finish off coming this way, keeping your arms straight and reaching with your fingers, trying to go as far as you can. And head down and breathe. Literally, I can feel my whole entire upper body completely engaging. And then we're gonna stretch straight up. You can actually do this a couple times. Come back down here again, come forward. Go up. All right, so that's my stretching routine for this evening. Every evening it's a little bit different depending on what muscles I need to cater to. But in this routine, we covered the areas that are most prone to building tension, such as the neck, the wrist, elbow, rear delts, the hips, and the legs, of course. And we got our blood circulating through our whole body. So thank you guys so much for watching. I had a lot of fun showing you my evening routine. Let me know what you want me to cover next in the comment section down below, and I will see you guys next Thursday. Mad love, peace out. Smash that like button, guys.